The deadly xenomorph has always been the antagonizing force within the alien universe, but the mostly unseen company, Wayland yutani remains in the periphery, working at any cost to gain a specimen of the creature. Many would argue that, as dangerous as the Xenomorph is, the company is just as much of a villainous presence in the series, with corporate greed and generally misguided scientific pursuits leading to the deaths of many innocent lives. So how did the idea of this company come to be? A long-standing rumor is that the name of the company came from Ridley Scott himself, who had neighbors named both Waylon and Yutani, and hated them, so he decided to, quote, dedicate the name of the evil company to them. This has, however, been debunked as a complete myth, and the true inspiration of naming the company came from designer Ron Cobb, who, in an interview, clarified the name. Wayland yutani for instance, is almost a joke, but not quite. I wanted to imply that poor old England is back on its feet and has united with the Japanese, who have taken over the building of spaceships the same way they have now with cars and super tankers. In coming up with a strange company name, I thought of British Leyland and Toyota, but we couldn't use Leyland Toyota in the film. Changing one letter gave me Wayland, and Yutani was a Japanese neighbor of mine. Also worth noting, despite being conceptualized since Alien in 1979, and with the logo for the company being seen all over in Aliens, the company name, Wayland yutani has never been directly mentioned until Alien 3 where Clemens, played by Charles Dance, explains to Ripley that the prison planet she's crashed on, Fury 161, is one of Wayland yutanis backwater work prisons. Aside from a deleted line in Alien Resurrection, and considering each Alien film to follow has been a prequel, this actually marks the only time that Wayland yutani has been mentioned by name in an Alien film. This has been an Alien Trivia Minute, bringing fun facts and interesting anecdotes about the Alien series. I hope you enjoyed today's trivia, and stay tuned for more. And until next time, this is Alien Theory, signing off.